हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम रजा मसूद टुडे विल डिस्कस अबाउट अ टॉपिक प्लान वैल्यू और शॉर्ट फॉर्म एस पी वी फ्रेंड टुडेज टॉपिक इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट विद रेफरेंस टू इफ यू आर अ स्टूडेंट इन स्टडिंग प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजमेंट इन यूनिवर्सिटी और यू आर प्लानिंग टू गिव एग्जाम ऑफ पी एम पी सो फ्रेंड दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दैट यू मस्ट हैव टू नो द कंसेप्ट ऑफ प्लान वैल्यू बिकॉज यू विल डेफिनेटली सी दिस टॉपिक इन द एग्जाम आई दर इट्स अ प्रोजेक्ट मैनेजमेंट एग्जाम और अदर इट्स यूनिवर्सिटी लेवल एग्जाम of uh, project management or pmp exam so friend you must have to know about this topic because at least 5 to 10 questions will definitely be there in the exam which are directly related to this topic second friend if you are a professional project manager and working in any organization as a project manager so you uh, your knowledge should be there for plan value that what is plan value and how to use it in the implementation of projects so friend let's start uh first of all i would request to please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you so let's start plan value friend uh plan value or uh, short form is pv uh basically it's a topic uh mainly it's a topic of project management and under project management it's a topic related to earned value okay so first of all friend uh, one by one we have to discuss uh, the all the things basically uh, revolve around project management and then earned value concept is there and under the concept of earned value there is a concept of planned value okay so first of all we have to understand what is basically project management first of all we have to start from there friend what is the project actually friend project is basically a temporary activity which has a beginning and ending point and it gives you a unique output or product that is called as a project for example if you are implementing e-commerce solution for a customer and you have to finish that project within 4 months and after 4 months the project will finish so we will say that it's a project okay so this is the definition of uh, a project for example take the same example of e-commerce solution is an example of a project similarly building of house building of flyovers uh, so build uh, introducing a new business process and company okay uh, uh, implementation of mobile application so all these are the example of a uh, project similarly uh, i want to ask what do you think that uh, production of chairs is an uh, is an example of uh, a project or not what do you say so friend production of chairs is not a project why because it is an ongoing task it is not temporary it is not unique so project uh, pr- production of chairs is not an uh, uh, is not an project why because project it must have to be a unique must have to be a uh, unique output and it should be a temporary thing it should be temporary okay so that is why production of chairs is not a project now if you can understand the concept of a project here friend uh, now we can talk about uh, the another very important concept of uh, the earned value concept friend friend earned value concept is that basically uh, you can say uh, whenever we talk about like what is the earning value earning value means that friend we have to think that uh, we plan something and based on plan thing we can uh, we can evaluate that how much we have earned basically earned means that how much we have received in actual for example just taken uh, in a general can concept of earned value means for example friend uh, you have to go from location a to location b to uh, meet your relative for example and you plan that within uh, within 2 hours you must have to uh, complete for example 20 kilometers you have to achieve you have to travel 20 kilometers okay so after 1 hour you must have to reach the 10 kilometers because your plan was that 2 hours are there within 2 hours you have to complete 20 kilometers you have to travel 20 kilometers so after 1 hour if you check you must have to complete the 10 kilometers okay so you are so but uh, w- after 1 hour when you check 
if you research, you check that you have only travel five kilometers because there are a uh, lots of traffic is there on the road and lo uh, ro road is blocked uh, on many places due to which you have only travel five kilometers so that means the earned value which you have earned is less than your planned value so that means you are not going as per the your planned value you must have to take some corrective actions <coughs> okay friend that is the concept of earned value here let me explain again you friend basically earned value concept is that you compare your planned value versus your actual value there are some thing planned value planned value what was the planned value you planned that within two hours you ha must have to complete 20 kilometers you, your planned value is that however the actual value was that after one hour you have achieved only five kilometers however as for the plan after one hour you must have to complete 10 kilometers so that means you are five kilometers behind actually so that means the uh, distance like uh, the um, you are traveling uh, as per uh, you are not traveling as per your planned uh, schedule you are behind the schedule so earned value basically friend the concept is that you basically compare your planned value versus your actual value and it gives you a you can say a progress report or you can say the alarming situation if needed that if you are going good it will tell you that you are going good if you are not going good so it will also tell you that you are not going good so friend it is very important that you must have to know that what things are going good what things are not going good so it basically earned value concept is that it basically compare the planned value versus actual value and it tells you the actual progress of your project in terms of time cost budget so that is the main concept of earned value here okay friend now here another uh, concept of uh, planned value now what is now planned value we are talking about again uh, planned value what is planned value friend planned value as per the concept of earned value is also known as budgeted cost of work of a schedule or BCWS as well it is defined as the amount of tasks that is supposed to have been completed it is mandatory term as a uh, portion of the task budget so friend basically planned value if we talk about planned value planned value just think something you have planned like you plan that you will complete that particular task in two hours this is your planned value you plan that you will complete the uh, building of house in six months this is your planned value you plan that uh, you will complete uh, you will purchase that particular thing ABC thing uh, with five thousand dollar cost for example so all these things basically are general sense it is a planned value friend this is called as concept of planned value just take an example here for example the task budget is five thousand dollar and the task start date is first january and the task plan date start uh, and finish date is 10th january okay there's an uh, there's a task which is planned to start from first january and it is planned to st finish on 10th january and the budgeted task uh, the budget of task is five thousand dollar if the task uh, if it is January 6 today for let's assume that it is 6 January today the task is supposed to be 60% complete why why 60% complete because see one uh, it the starting date is 1st January and the ending date is 10th January if that today's date is 6 January so it should have to be completed 60% 60% means that the uh, planned value what is the planned value 5000 multiplied by 60 percent so three thousand dollar work should have to be completed if today is 6 january how we have complete how we have calculated this how we have calculated the planned value planned value basically means the budget budget is five thousand dollar budget multiplied by uh, the percentage of planned work okay so if we multiply it for, with that so we can get the PV planned value okay friend are you getting my point so that is called as the concept of PV like 
if we have a budget of five thousand dollar and, and the starting date is first january and ending date is 10th january and so that if today is 6th january so 60 percent work should have to be completed so what we have done we multiply 60 percent with the budget budget is five thousand dollar so multiplying five thousand dollar multiply by 60 percent so three thousand dollar is the plan value pv so three thousand dollar work should have to be completed if today is sixth january so friend thank you thanks a lot for your time and that's all from my side i hope you like this video thank you thanks a lot for your time